Having trouble with your music, you don't know what to do You're stuck on a project, don't know how you'll make it through Well, DJ Megan, that is here, he'll turn that frown upside down We'll show you some cool stuff on the School of Sounds Welcome to the School of Sound with DJ Mega Man. Today I'm going to teach you how to make a wobble bass line inside of Ableton Live and Massive. A lot of people have been asking me how to make a wobble sounding kind of bass line. And it's used in a lot of popular electro and popular dubstep songs. Um, here's an example I came up with. And what I used to make this was Massive. Let's listen. As you can hear, very, very wobbly, sounds like it's talking a little bit. I'm basically going to show you guys how to create that from scratch. So, delete this, deleting massive, and open up another MIDI track, go to my plugin six section, double click on massive. Okay, it opens up basically a brand new sound. Now, on oscillator one, I'm gonna select under the digital and hybrid section, modern talking. Let's see how this sounds. Draw a MIDI clip. I'm just gonna drag this, drag this all the way out. As you can hear, not very much talking or wobbling going on with that. So what we're gonna do is, we're gonna take LFO5, drag it over here to this, left click, move it up a little bit. Now what this is gonna do, it's gonna basically use this curve to move that knob up and down, and it'll sound kinda like this. Okay, now you heard it go off beat a little bit. The reason why is because the sync isn't pressed. So what we're going to do is press sync on that. Now you're going to hear the timing of the curve be on beat. Sounds cool. So what we're going to do from there, we're going to add a little sub bass to it. We turn on oscillator 2. Under basic, square saw one, I'm just gonna keep it there. As you can hear, that's way too loud. Now I'm gonna turn down the amp just a tad bit. Turn down the intensity. Now we're also gonna make it an octave lower by going minus 12. Now you got a pretty nice little sub bass there. Now we're going to go over to LFO6. Take that, drag that to your filter section, filter 1. I'm going to select low pass 4. And we're going to do the same thing. We're going to left click, move it up a little bit. Let's hear what that sounds like real quick. Okay, obviously that's a little too much. So let's turn on the rest knobs. Make sure you have the sync. Okay, now for the crossfade right here, you want to make sure it's up so that way it's just using this sine wave right here. Now, there it is. That's pretty much your wobble bass line. Now to add a couple effects, I'm just going to go here, I'm going to add the classic tube, a little bit of distortion. Let's turn this filter off real quick just so we can hear what it's doing. Okay, sounds kind of cool. Go to here, FX2, make sure it's on. Chorus Ensemble. Sounds kind of cool too. Let's turn the filter back on. Sounds great. Now what we're going to do here, just to take it a quick step further, uh, this little control right here, this can be attached to any um, MIDI controller. All you got to do is right click, 
And you can go to MIDI Learn and, and attach that to any of uh, like a modulation wheel, pitch wheel, whatever you want, or even a knob. Okay. Now I'm going to take this, grab that right there, put the two right there, do the same thing, left click, and then move, push it all the way up. So you can see it going up and down right there. Now, since this two is all the way down, what it's actually doing is using this curve down here. You can select a different variation. That's a little bit too extreme, but we'll just use that for example. Now, if you move it all the way up, what it does is it crossfades to this section right here. So now you can throw in different variations. That's pretty cool. That's basically it. That's how to create. Uh, your wobble bass sound inside of Massive and Ableton Live. I'm DJ Mega Man. Having trouble with your music, we don't know what to do. You're stuck on a project, don't know how you'll make it through. Well, DJ Mega Man is here, he'll turn that frown upside down. We'll show you some cool stuff on the screen of sounds.